Good morning and welcome to Church Online. We are Dawlish Christian Fellowship transitioning to Hope Church and the official date for that is the 10th of July, so not long now. We are on number five of a five week series called Is Anyone Thirsty? And it's all about the Holy Spirit. And today Guy is going to be talking about fruity gifts. If you haven't joined us before, then I'd really encourage you to go back onto the website and watch the other four in this series because they really are wonderful teaching all about the Holy Spirit. And also on the website, just under where you connected for the service today, is the link to the Zoom chat. At 12 o'clock, we would love to see you there, anybody who's available. I've been thinking about how the Holy Spirit has been changing me as we've been going through this series and there's lots to work on, the fruit and the gifts and um, just the relationship really. And um, I've also been thinking about how the Holy Spirit has been changing the atmosphere on the estate where the new church build is going to be. I've heard some really exciting stories about how when we were put going through planning there was understandably some negativity and the Holy Spirit is turning it into positivity. So I would encourage you as a church family to keep praying and as we pray wouldn't it be wonderful if this was to happen from Acts chapter 4 verse 31. After they prayed, the place where they were meeting was shaken and they were filled with the Holy Spirit and spoke the word of God boldly. So Father God, as we come to this time of worship this morning to give you praise and thanks and to learn more about your Holy Spirit, we give you so much thanks for the work that you're doing in our own lives as a church family and also in preparation for the people who live around our new church build. And Father, this morning, as we come to think about your fruity gifts, and Guy speaks to us, oh, by your spirit, Lord, please reveal what you are saying to each one of us as a church. And we thank you and praise you for being an awesome, wonderful, perfect God, full of love. Amen. <laughs> 